talk about your relationship. I know both of you want to be at the cir- in the circle all the time, but you can only be one at a time. How do you guys deal with that? Um, I don't know. I feel like I'm very supportive of her. And, yes. <laughs> like, I know she is the starting goalie, but I want every, like, every, like, for her to do well and succeed. And so I, I cheer her on and everything. Now, um, what's it like to have somebody who you know can take over at any moment? How much do you lean on her for support and help? Because, you know, she's a senior. She's, she's got to be a big sister. Definitely. Um, I mean, she helps me a lot, like, in practice and everything, just because it's like if I'm not doing well and I see her doing well, it, like, makes me want to play as well as she is at the moment. So, like, I don't know. <laughs> I guess it makes me push. This is kind of a mirror of what happens in front of you with your close defense. You've got four girls, two sophomores, two seniors. How did you guys blend and become a unit that where you really trust each other and know what each other's going to do this quickly? Um, well, like, I obviously know the sophomores just because they're in my grade, um, and the seniors are last year, so that was really easy for me. Yeah, uh, so. Talk well, about what Glade and Maddie do to, to, to help make that a unit. Well, they, well, Glade's obviously very loud, and Bando is just, she's an awesome defender, and she is very positive, so she is able to, like, criticize, but knows like to hold back and like she's a very you know, I don't know she's just a very good defender now uh, I know an offensive player gets an open shot on either one of you 90% of the time they're going to score you have to rely on your defense to make it tough on them and how important is, are those girls in front of you oh, very important um, I mean they basically make it so that I'm not well Sam and I aren't just getting shot at one-on-one because that's kind of impossible to save everything. So the fact that they like push them in certain directions helps us have a better save percentage, I guess. The goals are great, but do you get more pumped up for, to see a great defensive play, a great check, a great positional play? It, it's honestly a relief uh, for me yeah. just because it's like I'm anticipating getting shot at and like mentally saying, okay, I need to save this, whereas when someone checks it, it's like, oh, now I don't have to think about that, and now you can go and score instead. Do you see how hard your defense is working and- and like doesn't want you to get the shot on, and it helps you. Like, it just kind of pumps up everyone. It's like an interception. Right. Coming into the season, your low defense had to be a concern because you had a lot of young kids, yep. a young goalie, two young players, and that has to be a unit. How did they come together like that? Well, we came out in the very beginning of the season. We realized that we had uh, a few defense, low defense positions to fill. Glade was actually a midfielder last year, so we made the decision as a coaching staff to move Glade to a defense, to the defensive end as a low defender. We already had Maddie Vandemer back there. We had Lily and Sam Rogers back there as well. But uh, instead of putting in three sophomores or three new people. That's why we moved Glade back, and uh, Aaron Dugan and Dana Spires stepped right up. They they won those positions, and they've been playing great all season. Is that that's not not typical? Because sometimes you know these kids are two years younger. It's had had. Is it a lot of the seniors making sure that the, that they feel welcomed? And yeah, no, the senior girls and I had talked to the seniors in the beginning and told them, listen, there's going to be a lot of upper underclassmen that are going to have to come in and fill these positions that in order for your team to be successful you have to make them you have to be welcoming to them you have to give them tips give them constructive criticism but that you also have to be there positive and support them so that they have the confidence and know that they can play with the, all this senior Latin team and the seniors did that and welcomed them with open arms and they've been great goalies are a different breed anyway uh, how much does Sam help Lily and to, ha- to have someone to bounce ideas off of yeah especially because Sam's a senior uh, she's been it's not her first rodeo she's been here before and the two of them are great friends they push each other every day practice they sit together on the bus and stuff so it, it's nice with the camaraderie that they have and to help each other out and give each other constructive criticism as well